All right, it's time to get this match going. Oh, no. Lesnar's about to end this. Oh, five. This could be the chance he was looking for. I don't know if Sin Cara can recover. Big elimination right there. Back between the ropes. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Looking vulnerable now, guys. Oh, look at this. Look at the suplex off the top rope. Oh, oh, oh. jeez. Take all the wind out of you. Stomping down. Oh, he's got him up high. The fall away slam. Oh, he knew that was coming. Uh-oh, watch out. Cena's got him up. Attitude adjustment. How do you come back from that? But can John Cena capitalize? Wow. John Cena with a nice reversal. Cena yeah. looking for the AA. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. He's got his best opportunity right in front of him. Got to make the second one count. Fall away slam. You got Here it comes. Looking for Tough spot to be in. Over time, there have been various types of six-man teams that have been successful. There are family trios like the Guerreros, the Grams, the Andersons, and the Von Erichs. There have been members of factions who have also produced tremendous six-man teams like the Fabulous Freebirds, the Four Horsemen, the NWO, and D-Generation X. Waist lock. No, no. Oh, belly to belly. My goodness. An early pin attempt. Plenty of fight left. Not yet. Byron, you mentioned some families and groups that created incredible six-man teams. Talking more about factions. Don't forget about the likes of the Hart Foundation, Evolution, the Wyatt Family, the Shield, and the New Day. These are only some of the trios who had unbelievable matches against a variety of adversaries. If we're talking about three-man teams, I need to shout out one of the baddest trios of all time who held the World Six-Man Championship on a number of occasions. I'm talking about the American Dream Dusty Rhodes and the Road Warriors. When the Dream put on the face paint, you knew it was going to be a bad night for their opponents. He's looking to bring this one to the outside where things can get ugly in an instant. Here's Cena. Driving him to the canvas with the attitude adjustment. And another kick out. Hey, I guess you never know. Here's Cena. Attitude adjustment. Nobody hits that one better. Oh, man. Big Show is in trouble now. He's got some more fight in him, guys. Oh, are you kidding me? Everything's destroyed. Oh, you're going to pay for this? Quick roll up. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point, making those south of the border fans proud. Bringing it back into the ring. Oh, and the reversal. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Man, Big Show was able to get out of the way there. Deceptively fast. Spine Buster! There's going to be a lot of big moves in this match. 
But one question is going to be, who will capitalize on those moves the best? Oh, looks like we're going to see it! Oh! Del Sol! Looks like this show is over, guys. I don't know. That could be it. The Undertaker has him up! Tombstone! That hit the spot. He's finished. That'll likely do it, Michael. Kalisto is still in this. Somehow, some way. The Undertaker has him up! Lesnar did it! What a performance! Was there ever any doubt? Let's look back on the action from the last match. A very decisive victory here tonight. Let's not overcomplicate things. This business is simple. It's all about wins and losses.